one of the things that's a huge blessing to, to San Diego is uh, Maurizio Cerasini, who, who actually did the imaging. And as he did the imaging, he looked at the painting for the real color, and then the infrared, and then uh, ultraviolet. And, and simply then, by doing all three of them at the same time, you can look through the painting to see what's under it. And that was a huge surprise to see that there's something under the paintings. When, when Leonardo was commissioned by an art patron to, to paint the painting, uh, it was an adoration of the Magi, so you could think of Jesus, Mary, Joseph. And, and yet, when, um, when people look at the painting, it's not the same quality as the rest of his paintings. So when, uh, when Leonardo was doing the imaging, as he imaged underneath the painting, he discovered that there's a whole drawing under there. And the underneath is the infrared painting or picture of the charcoal that Leonardo actually used to, uh, to draw it. And then, much like paint by numbers, the painting was done on top of the drawing. Um, maybe as an example, you can look at the horse that's right here. There are more, there are more portraits in this picture than any of the other Leonardo's. And um, the thing that's extraordinary about his creativity is that this is all done with no erasing. So this is how somebody drew it, versus if you just look at the natural, the, the natural is nothing like it um, in, in the quality. Or another piece of looking at this, this part of the upper part of the painting, um, there's really not much there at all that's of interest. And yet if you fade off, all of a sudden you see that the drawing underneath has all of these people that are there. And those people um, are, are doing motion. That, that was when Leonardo was testing out motion. And they were rebuilding this temple that's here that has lunations on it that are very typical of Egyptian pagan religions. And, and so it turns out that uh, Leonardo was drawing a metaphor. And so he, he was drawing the battle of good and evil. He was drawing the resurgence of pagan religions in Christ's time. And the person that paid the bills didn't want that. So he fired him. And, and so somebody else came in and drew over the top of it and got rid of all the stuff he didn't want. And so now when you look under the painting, you actually see what Leonardo's real creativity is. And that's a huge contribution Maurizio has done, is we now look under the painting and we see what's really there.